Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So I'm back to painting, which is very exciting. I took a, about a two week break after the design fair. I kind of felt a bit burned out. <laughs> but um, yeah, um, so today's video is about the Sone gouache paint set in metallic colors. I will be reviewing them for you and demoing them in a painting. So this set comes with six colors, six lovely colors, a copper, an Aztec gold, a bronze, a light silver, which you have to shake up a bit to make the pigment blend, an Inca gold and a deep silver. Uh, the set retails on eBay for $16, which I think is a very fair price. Actually, all the art supplies from this particular brand are pretty fair priced. This is a Russian brand, which I've never used before. And it usually makes student grade art supplies, so I think that's why the price point is so okay. But it also has some professional paints you can use. So on the side they say that it can be applied over a smooth surface, best suited for paper, cardboard and padded canvas. It also claims that it has high light fastness, which means that due to exposure to light it won't fade that easily. It also has um, the claim that it has perfect spreading and excellent opaqueness. Now as you will see, I did some swatches for you, you see my initial thoughts uh, on the paints and the swatches are so and so, I did them on white paper and on black paper. I will say that not all the colors have an excellent opaqueness, I think the copper has the most pigment to it and the spreadability is kind of relative, it really depends on how much water you're adding to them and what kind of brush you are using. So for today's painting I chose to do a portrait of one of my favorite singers, Borns, and I added some botanical elements to it and painted over gouache with these metallic colors. So to wrap this up, I think the positives of getting this set is the price point. The fact that you get a variety of metallic colors and also I think the quantity in the small jars is a pretty big quantity so you'll have these colors for quite a while. And I think they look pretty impressive once you get them to be opaque. The minuses I think that uh, they don't have a perfect spreading as they claim to. Some colors are not as good as others. Some are more opaque, some are, have more pigment to them. For example, the light silver is, uh, you really have to shake it up and it's kind of hard to get a perfect application of it. And I think that's all the minuses I can come up with. So if you would like to see how I use these paints in my actual illustration, just click on the timestamp in the description box because it does take a while <laughs> until I uh, start using them in the video. And the other materials that I've used in this illustration are my Windsor and Newton palette, my gouache uh, paints and uh, some pastels for some color pops. So anyways, I hope you enjoyed this kind of video. Let me know in the comment section if you have used this uh, gouache paint set and what do you think about it. And for more, please subscribe. I put out videos weekly and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.